Hey, Giancarlo, it seems like you're heating up at the plate a little bit. What's been the biggest difference for you when you step into the batter's box? Um, uh, keeping, keeping with my plan and uh, having, having a good plan, actually, and keeping with uh, And just being on time, being on time for, for and, uh, adjusting to everything. You mentioned having a good plan. What's the difference between the plans you had in the past and, and the one you evolved to? Um, I, I, uh, let me rephrase. Sticking to my plan instead of, uh, you know, going back and forth, uh, letting him dictate the switch as opposed to me dic dictating the switch of my plan. You guys know you have a lot of talented hitters in this lineup and always have said you guys are getting close. It's a matter of time. But is there anything to the last couple of days being able to, to put up some the Cleveland series and then obviously today being able to, to hit the ball out of the ballpark a little bit? Uh, I think having good at bats is contagious. So, you know, you, you see see how the pitcher and the the opposing team in general is attacking us and, uh, you know, taking, taking their best pitches and, and squaring their best pitches up. Um, you know, it's good to feed off of. So I think a little bit of that and, um, and it's warming up in general. So uh, we, we like that. The next question from Marley Rivera. Hi, Giancarlo, what do you do specifically to stay patient? You know, obviously you are performing very well at the plate right now, but that took uh, work and patience from your, on your part. Um, just uh, understand, I mean, you, you know, something you constantly have to be reminded of and you fall, yeah. fall out of it um, sometimes when, when you get out there and the game speeds up. But it's uh, it's really knowing that it's it's his job to make me come out the strike zone first and then to come in the zone. So uh, just just tightening it up and, and being on time when it isn't there is, is the biggest key. When we talked to uh, Marcus Thames, one of the things that he told us for you, the key is pitch selection. Do you feel that that, is, that has been the biggest improvement, uh, especially yeah. as we see you? Yeah, yeah. Um, tighten up the zone, swing it, swing it, good strikes, uh, not pitchers' pitches, and uh, good things will happen. Let's go next to Eric Bolin. John Keller, I know you're not facing him, but when Domingo is on the way that he was the last five innings against Cleveland, the way he was all night tonight, what do you think makes him such a tough at bat? I uh, love to see it. Um, he, he, the ball's going all over the place, and he's throwing, you know, mid to upper 90s. So uh, just the reaction time and and uh, the pitch selection they got to deal with it is very tough. You know, when you can throw. Uh, four pitches in the zone and starting in the zone and breakouts very difficult at bat and uh, he was on all cylinders tonight. Well,